All right. Let's get this done, shall we? I have made my decision. And to for real, for real, even speak on it, I took time away from everything <clears throat> just so I could see how I felt. And yeah, I realized I needed that time to get, you know, just to get away from everything, you know, chill out, focus on myself a lot more and come to thinking on like, like I had a really, <clears throat> I had a real deep conversation with myself, like last week, like in the same spot, you know what I mean? Like I had to really, like I had to check myself, you know what I'm saying? I had to real life beat myself up for the bullshit I had done last year and the year prior. And real shit, 2018 to 2021. Wow. <laughs> it, it's crazy to even admit some of that. You know, the shit that I did between a three year period, you know. And, like, looking back on it, for real, for real, looking back on it as hard as I did, I realized how shitty of a person I was. And I realized I could do better. <clears throat> I can be better. I can do better. And I should do and be better. So I have made my decision and I have decided to continue YouTube. And I've decided to continue YouTube under the same moniker with everything that I've had, everything I've done. You know, I'm sure all of you have been seeing, you know, the new uploads and stuff like that. And it's crazy to really like, like when you really like hardcore think about it like that, like when you really, really, really think about it, <clears throat> excuse me, like I'm, I'm like real live, like like I had to, like I had to really teach myself how to love myself. You know what I'm saying? Like, cause I look back on how it started, how it was going, how it was going before and after I left YouTube for an extended period. Like I, com like when I say I completely ignored YouTube. The only thing that I had, and when I checked my YouTube studio, I had a whole bunch of unfinished uploads. I had a whole bunch of scheduled inform scheduled content, content that I had almost completely forgot about. And I'm not just talking about on the on the on the game channel. I'm not just talking about on my rap channel. I'm talking about on on all three for real for real, like. People calling me on my call on my phone. People hitting me up on Instagram. People hitting me up on Twitter. Blah blah blah. Like, I never really thought how far I had gotten and how much respect from the community that I had 
and like real talk like you 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 get to that level where I spent so much time really giving a fuck about myself in a sense like I was worried about what others thought and I began to really really like heavily like cons consider that and I realized in the back of my mind, like, I do give a fuck what people think, but at the same time, I don't. Because in between, like, 2018 and now, for example, like, like, for example, the relationship with my son and his mother has most definitely improved. And... Even she was just telling me, like, you need to, you know, this is not you. Like, you're not happy. Like, I know, I know you personally. You know, people between, you know, my collaborators and my associates outside of the industry that I've built upon, not built myself into. And I realized, like, it's not that, it's not that you're, a, you're, you're, like, like all all shit aside, like I am really a fucking horrible person. Like let's keep it a buck. Let's keep it a buck eighty. You know what I'm saying? And it's okay to be a shitty person. Don't get it twisted. It's okay to be a shitty person. You know, it's okay for that, you know, and even now, like <clears throat> Excuse me. Even now, like, it's okay to be, you know, shit. You know what I'm saying? It's okay. Because, like, real life, at the end of the day, like, like, even my peoples is like, like, I clearly don't give a fuck about my family. And the people I have outside my family, like, genuinely do give a fuck and I'm just like that's crazy so for me it's like I don't know I feel revigorated a little bit yeah I fucked up pretty bad last year major and even now like that shit still partially eats me up inside like but it ain't really nothing I can do about it. You know what I'm saying? Like, if if I was really at that point, like I wanted to real life, like let it go, I could, but I will, I can't. You know what I'm saying? So from this point forward, I'm doing whatever, but I'm focused on me. You know what I'm saying? I'm focused on me. I'm not focused on nothing else at this point. My collaborators, my personal life, my my brand, I'm doing me. And that's just what it's gonna be from this point forward. And I'm just gonna keep it straight like that. And I and I have no hesitation in none of that anymore. And I'm cool with that. I'll accept my faults as a person and I'll accept it as for what it is. But now I got a clearer head and I'm much better in my position than what I was previous. Oh yeah. Putting in putting my I'm kicking putting my best foot through the door on this one. And now that I'm seeing that everybody real live is loving everything that I'm doing, my likes increased, my my views have increased like I went up a whole six, seven subscribers within the almost month I've been off of the, off off camera. You know what I'm saying? And I'm happy for that because it's somebody that real life do give a fuck about me, and I'm okay with that. So even if it is just the people like you guys who see me behind that screen, if that's what that if that's what it is, and it don't gotta be nobody else outside my shit, it don't gotta be nobody inside right behind me or sitting next to me. Cool.
I'm good with that. Simple as that. So, I'm back. So, coming back at it 100%.